7.3, we have a delegation from Mr. Jadvinder Sodhi of the Homeowners Welfare Association. Mr. Sodhi, the floor is yours. You have five minutes. Uh, good morning, Chair and the members of the Council Committee. Thank you very much given, uh, for giving us an opportunity. Adil Mack is with me, other members of the, the Homeowners Welfare Association and concerned residents are from their PCs and listening. We request to give us maybe a minute or so extra uh, because Adil has to close the box on the funding on the safe city. So going back to the delegation, uh, Homeowners Welfare Association is no name for standing up the grassroots irrespective of your social, religious, political beliefs, differences. We stand together united for our own Brampton. So road and public safety is, is, is a key along with Adil's remarks. We would request separate meeting to initiate a new proposal to eliminate public concerns of road safety. I live on Mayfield Road, you know, everyday accidents, Highway 50 everyday accidents. The cameras has been put it on the local streets, which could have been more, right, which could have helped more, right? And uh, another one is uh, four angels lost life. The Yaz Chaudhry's incident happened, daylight robbery at Confort in Brampton East. Heavy traffic on Mayfield, we talk about that. And next one is you see a lady got gunshot by the police. And last week I post a video which has been seen by 30 plus thousand people, 560 shares. That means Brampton is really concerned. Our pages are active pages in the community. And same incident happened on Mayfield, there's another picture three angels picture the lady and the next one is suraj deep daylight three o'clock he got just for the phone that means brampton has a problem we understand justice system is everyone listening hello <laughs> is the voice Stone, coming in? coming through loud and clear yes, yes please. thank you thank you i just want to ensure that so brampton let this gentleman got lost. We appreciate the Patrick's initiatives on asking to have these teenagers in the, bring in the justice system. We appreciate those uh, initiatives by Patrick Brown, our mayor, and the council. And same thing, some incidents I can I can list the name on July 24th, 27th, 28th, 31st, 4th, August, 6th, August, 13th, 13th again, 13th again, 14th, 21st, 1st September shooting and again one lady got killed in the driveway so many incidents on top of it so many incidents are not recorded police just send in a response back hey go to your insurance company so those are not recorded people don't understand what to do in this case robbery every day we have delegated last year year before year before year. from last 2014 we are continuously almost every year delegating to the field region to the city of Brampton on public safety. So we have been active and engaged with the community and we have done so many town halls on safety and other public issues. It's it's a known group. We are we, we would like to have some requests, separate meeting with the with the team so that we can propose some of the good ideas which maybe will be helpful uh, for the city and the region. And we will be delegating Peel Police Board. We will be delegating to the region of Peel, but six of the members in the, this sitting council represent at regional level and along with our mayor. And three mayors, Mississauga, Brampton, and Caledon, sits on the police board. So that means there is a fair amount of representation from our city. And also incidents happen in the city. I think it's a collaborative and collective responsibility of all of us <laughs> residents and our politicians either it's a federal provincial or municipal it's a collaborative effort to improve our city you have been designated you have been elected to represent us we expect very high from our elected representatives and we are raising a flag with the provincials regularly and with the federals too we're going to be meeting them individually on this safety concern because people in brampton are completely not feeling safe and another one is a police station. We understand that there is a limited of resources and everything else, but same time, and I, where I live, uh, Brampton, uh, Mayfield and Highway 50 is 19 or 20 kilometers from the police station in, 
in Bramley City Center. There's another one on Hard Ontario. Next one opened up. We, we, we appreciate you open up in a downtown Brampton, but you see Brampton West, how far it's gone up to Winston Churchill and Mayfield. How far is Highway 50 and uh, Mayfield is east side. Then south is same thing. The, the city has been grown too fast, too far. It's a house of houses. So in order to provide the services, essential services, fire and uh, the police presence, I'm not, I, we understand that we can't have a police presence in every house and every place, but they, if they are more on the road, if their focus is on public safety, if we disengage the, the, the criminal groups, that will help the city to grow fast and city council and uh, even citizens are willing to support if you call a meeting with the, with the provincials or federal MP, MPs and MPPs, we would like to be participate. We will support you, but you need to take initiative and please appreciate what the, the citizens are doing for the residents. Again, uh, increase police presence to control criminal activities, police station in Brampton East West, reform new policies to assure public road safety, strict enforcement against criminals, public engagement in advisory board and other reforms. We don't know who with who's, who are on the police board advisory city. I, we understand that it's a political positions and the committees are being gone, given to friends, not kind of people who are engaged, who are working for it. That's fine. But we need to have more engaged. You can add more people on the board who are actively working for, for the community. So sport initiative of Safe Brampton, that's a new initiative we are taking on under the banner of Homeowners Welfare Association. And we appreciate on behalf of Jyotvinder Sodhi, Sukhvinder Chilla, Sukhjot Naru, Harinder Chima, Sukhvinder Samra, and Adil Mack. Adil Mack is here. She will close the remarks on safety issues, please. Hi there. Thanks for listening to our presentation. And as you will see from this presentation, there are many points that we are concerned about within our city, many safety points. Um, contrary to the IC report, there is another entity that would like to bid on Brampton safety funds. This entity is the most senior to any other group that has been out there. As we just found out on Facebook that there are going to be funds bid on today for safety in our city. Um, we are asking for our opportunity to present what Safe City Brampton can bring to our city. We are requesting to come back within 30 days to present our full presentation on how to make Brampton safe. Thank you very much. And it's a collaborative effort and we would like to work with the city, <laughs> region of Peel, MPPs, MPs, because you are the policy maker. You are the one who's going to lead us. You're going to give us a direction. We will follow the footsteps with a collaborative, positive, engaged community. These are the few names of thousands of members in our groups. Paul, you're muted. Thank you for that. Uh, I have on my board, Councillor Williams to speak. Uh, through the chair, I believe Councillor Singh is before me. My apologies. Councillor Singh, you're up first. I'm just, uh, are we are we moving, uh, I'm just confused. Are we moving a staff report or are we uh, moving a uh, receipt? Uh, as I understand it, Councillor Singh, uh, the delegation has asked for an opportunity to engage with uh, the city and to have their concerns listened to in more detail. Okay, because my, my suggestion would be to, um, I think the approach uh, uh, the team is using is, is good. I think um, the delegation and the police, I think, I think uh, that's a right approach. And maybe I suggest um, instead of a staff court uh, with the uh, chair of uh, with uh, the safety advisory committee, I think also investigate uh, there and maybe decide uh, first so that we can get into a more concrete uh, discussion um, with other stakeholders as well. Uh, but I'll leave that off to Sir Williams and uh, thank you uh, for your deputation. Uh, my question just in return is when are your dates to delegate and with the police services? Uh, sorry, we, because it was a disconnect a little bit. Can you please repeat your question? 
You said you had dates to delegate at uh, police services and uh, region? Yes, the police services board has uh, responded back to us. They said we will not take a virtual uh, presentation, but it will be read out by the staff member. That's what their protocol is in the past. Yeah. And region, we have given them information and looking forward to, I think it's on 15th or so. And looking forward to your sport because you are the champions of Brampton. Our regional councillors, our councillors, our mayor, and everyone. But we, together, we want to make our city, our region safe for our children, for our seniors, because they are sitting at home without a much. Because when I'm working, I feel my children, my mom at home, unsafe. How are they going to uh, retract to if somebody break the door and come in? And gunpoint in just uh, five, six doors away from my home, uh, there was a gunpoint rob robbery last term, and we have delegated on that as well, along with so many issues has been not been recorded. Yeah. And Harkir, uh, thank you very much. You're always supportive, and you represent me, the entire team we represent from different councillors. But uh, thank you very much for your ongoing support. Yeah, no, and uh, and I think that's a good approach. And uh, yeah, my thing would be instead of just asking for a staff report, maybe we uh, refer this to the uh, safety advisory committee with Councillor Williams uh, and continue the discussion there because the important discussion and um, you know all stakeholders that are part of that committee, all wards should perhaps be a part of it. Uh, but I'll let Councillor Williams um, speak to what she wants to do. Thank you. Thank you, Councillor Singh. Councillor Williams. Uh, thank you to the chair. Thank you, Jervinder and Adele for coming forward and um, expressing your concerns. Community safety is a, is a high priority for all of us on council. And um, so I will move receipt of your delegation and um, for you to um, come back to, st uh, to co collaborate with staff and then also to present to the community safety advisory committee. I think the members there would be really interested in hearing some of your ideas and suggestions. And um, so at the next Community Safety Advisory Committee, when we have a confirmed date, um, it would be great to have you on the agenda for that. Um, and thank you very much, uh, Councilor Williams, and uh, for your ongoing support. And you have seen, even when we did the barbecue, you were present, I think Harkira Singh was present. We always have a diverse and, uh, and all community engagement together. That's what we believe in because Brampton is a very diverse city and we have to have every stakeholder, not only the politicians from the community to be part of it together, we can make Brampton the best place because we are lacking of uh, the, the employment opportunities. Transportation, we have so many gaps over the decades, which we understand the challenges on you, you champions are facing the challenges today, but together, I think we can reduce the gaps when we highlight Please don't consider the, we are pointing out fingers at you people who represent us. We are pointing a finger on the gaps uh, for a appropriate resolution by working together. It's a team effort. Okay, thank you, Jadvinder. I have no further questions. Mr. Clerk, just for clarity, do we also have Adele Rochon present? Through you, Mr. Chair, I believe she did speak at the end of uh, Jadvinder's remarks. Very good. Okay, thank you. So I see no further questions. We have a motion from Councillor Williams as displayed on the screen. No questions. All in favor? Anyone against? That carries.